Start with the white side up, and then fold the diagonals. Go back to the colored side, and then fold in half in both directions. Now collapse a water bomb base. Now fold this corner to the top corner. Now fold the corner down and unfold. We're going to divide this part into fourths. So fold this corner to here, making sure it aligns with the crease we made. Now divide the other two sections in half too. And unfold the flap. Now we're going to repeat this on the other three flaps of the water bomb base. Crimp inside along this crease. To do that, I'm going to unfold everything, fold along this, and then collapse again. But while we're collapsing again, we fold along these two valley folds. Now we're going to open sink in and out along these folds. I'll start with this one. Now sink this flap back out. And sink in one more time. And then it'll look like this. You'll have this extra flap here. And then repeat on the three other flaps. And now the base is done. So now we're gonna start the shaping. So first make this top part round. So most of the creases won't have any references anymore, so just pinch this flap in half. Do the same thing for the other flaps. And it'll look like this. Now we're going to fold the layer here. Repeat here, and on the other sides. Now we're going to sink this part in so that you don't see it anymore. I'm just going to smash it in because all I care is that you don't see it. Then I'll sink the other flaps. The next step is to fold this flap in half, but my paper is too thick, so I'm gonna glue it. It also helps for shaping, but you don't have to do it. Now I'll fold the flaps in half. Lastly, I'm gonna curl these flaps and open some pockets for the eyes and bend the head backwards a little. A few touch-ups and it's done. So if you folded this, you can post it to any of the links in my about page. And don't forget to tag me and I'll see you in the next video.